What's up guys, we're back for another video. Today, we're working on the M3. We're gonna be painting the uh, calipers purple to match the car and the hardware on the wheels. So uh, let's get at it. All right guys, we got one side scuffed up, cleaned up, ready to go. I'm gonna hit it with some primer first to get some better coverage, got everything masked off. I'm gonna do one side at a time. I'm gonna set this one in primer. I'll clean the other side while this side is setting up and drying. All right, guys, we've got the primer on. As you can see, all taped up, nice. Primer's on. We'll walk over to the other side. First coat of primer's done on this side. I'm about to do the first coat of the anodized silver. So we got over here. So we're going with. Anodized purple. I'm gonna do a base coat silver, give it the effect. Shoot it on this side while it sets. I'll go to the other side, add another couple coats of primer, and yeah, we'll get underway for some color. Alright, guys, I got the first coat of the anodized silver base coat. I don't know if you can really tell, it's a little more silverish chrome looking now. I'm gonna do about like four or five coats of this just to get a better effect but yeah there it is purple's next it'll match that real nice and it'll match the colorways on these AG wheels all right guys we're about to lay the uh, anodized purple Let's see how this bad boy comes out as you can see we got a silver chrome almost chromish looking finish to help out with the color I'll set you down here and I'm gonna see if I can get some footage of me spraying the color on all right here we go guys go very light the first first coat I'm not trying to get full coverage here guys just trying to Little bit of coverage. Since it's real transparent, go light, not too heavy to get runs. Alright, there's the first coat. Like I said, we didn't go too 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 heavy. That's just first coat. All right, guys, we're gonna go in with the second coat. Not too heavy. Just enough to get a little bit more coverage on this. As you can see, it's starting to turn a little more purple. Kinda has like a magenta look on the camera, but. Guys, I'm gonna come in with a little bit more, more color in a little bit. Just gonna let that sit set for a little bit. But man, almost has a candy coat color to it. Can't wait to see what the what it looks like after we're done. I'm gonna spray some clear coat as well. All right, guys, we're going in for another coat. We have pretty good coverage now, just testing up a couple spots.
Alright guys, looks like my camera's about to die, but we're about to do some clear coat to get it a little shinier. But that's what it looks like. It kind of looks like a magenta, almost like a hot pink in pictures and the camera doesn't do it justice. But it has like a deep, deep purple look to it, like a candy. Loving the way this looks. But yeah, I will snap pictures. And I will post everything in the description below of everything I used, the steps I did, and where you can get it. So guys, I'm back. Yesterday battery ran out on the GoPro. So I wasn't able to show you the rear calibers. It's dark right now. Can't really see them, but uh yeah. Heading to the tire shop to get new meat for these rear tires. Came across some issues. Real big issues. Let me show you here guys. Probably not ideal to be driving on. So, I'm gonna run over to the tire shop real quick, get some new tires, put on these wheels, and yeah, come back, reinstall them, take the car out for a little drive. All right, guys, forgot my camera here at the house when I went to get the tires. Not bad, but yep, yeah, got the tires, man. Some Kendas, a lot more meteor street and drift tires. Not like I'm going to drift in them, but shout out to my boy Daniel. Hooked it up. Now, put it on, give the car a little rinse, take it for a little drive. Yeah, let's get at it, guys. Alright, guys, here's the finished product on the uh, brake calipers. As you can see, purple. Get a shot of the front. Came out real good. I like them. Yeah, I'm gonna take it out for a drive now. So that, that'll be it for this video. Let me know if you like some more DIY videos. I can definitely post those. Like I said, I got a couple more things to do. But yeah, that's it, guys. Catch me on the next one.